The sound of enthusiastic youngsters on career day at Clayton County Smith Elementary. We need to start preparing our students now. We live in a very competitive world, a global society that they're going to have to compete with, and it is necessary for them to understand that as early as possible. So we start here at Smith Elementary in kindergarten. Young students being exposed early to all kinds of career choices. More than 60 different presenters offered motivation and advice on what's needed to succeed. We had careers from um, service technicians, police department, canine units, fire and safety. We had um, architects. We had um, independent owners, CEOs, presidents of companies. We had dancing instructors. We had Juno <laughs> instructors. We had doctors, surgical technicians here. I'm showing you, I'm showing you a little bit of what I do on a daily basis. Presenter Tony basis. Smith wanted the kids to know about what he called were those non-traditional careers. Um, my career as a personal trainer and an entrepreneur is different from a lot of the things that they've seen out in the public. I, and, uh, and, and this is a great opportunity for me to really put on display what, what individuals can do outside of the things that they see that are basic in, in the media right now. Most kids don't know anything outside of, oh, the doctors, the lawyers, the policemen, the fire chiefs. They know that, but there are other careers out there that can get them to where, get their goals done and get them to where they want to be. And what are you going to talk to them about? I'm talking to them about banking. Talking about what they should do when they grow up can sometimes prove challenging when speaking to kids in elementary school. How creative you have to be talking to young people? Creative is to make sure that we don't over talk, you know, go over the head. Make sure we talk about things that they can relate to. Talk about things that they would like to know about. Things that they're interested in. Things that they see every day. But these are not your everyday kids. The presenters quickly discovered these kids understood the importance of their education. How important is that? Oh, very important. <laughs> Why is it important? Because you get to feel stuff and you go to college, you learn more stuff. And how do you get there? By doing your best. I'm very proud of the students, the faculty and staff that assist with it, and the young people for the questions they ask. They, they, they cannot get enough of the um, enjoyment of learning. Kids were excited. Uh, they had the opportunity to, to engage with me in some exercise routines uh, and, and they really, really showed a great interest and I even seemed like I even made some, made some interest in, in personal training uh, from the guys and the ladies. So uh, there was a great opportunity for me to speak with them and I really, really appreciate the opportunity. An opportunity to touch the lives of young leaders of tomorrow who already know where they're headed. Attention!